Hi, this is Fortune Buchholz, and I'm here today to talk to you about another Arcana Sacra product. You'll remember that I talked about the publisher Arcana Sacra uh, very recently because they did the French version of Robert M. Place's Tarot of the Sevenfold Mystery, which they called Tarot of the Seven Virtues. Right now what we have here is a beautiful 160 page graphic novel or visual novel uh, about the journey of the fool, the fool's journey. It's by a wonderful French uh, tattoo artist and illustrator. Her name is Julie Lapierre, but she uses the pen name Gullivier Le Vinciere. As you can see, the book is amazing, right? It's a beautiful black book with real gold foil, so don't scratch it. And don't you love this cutout detail that shows the fool? Really charming hand-drawn art. And when you look at it, this may remind you of Park's famous uh, Korean manhwa, Tarot Cafe, which was so popular in the 90s. This is 160 pages, all beautifully hand-drawn. And it, as you would expect, it tells an interesting and charming version, very sincere, very earnest, of the Fool's journey, where the Fool goes through and meets each of the major arcana, receiving a gift or an insight, uh, and uh, having adventures with the characters on each card. Um, as you can see, there is some uh, diversity and a little nudity. If that is a concern for you, this may not be a book for children under 15. It is aimed both at beginning in advanced uh, tarotists, so it's a good way to introduce uh, teenagers or younger people to the tarot, but it also has a lot of subtle rewards for those of us who've been using uh, tarot for a long time. The iconography is roughly based in the Tarot de Marseille, the TDM, but it's not really um, strongly connected to it beyond uh, some of the visuals, so it doesn't require any particular deep uh, TDM knowledge. Uh, I really love this book. The binding is excellent, as you can see. The beautiful gold ribbon for the placeholder is well sewn in and should not fall uh, out under any normal use. Here is the back. If you would like to follow this artist, um, you can follow her. Uh, she's on Instagram under Gullivier Levinchere, and she has a very uh, interesting feed. If you ask me to compare this in the spectrum of the more notable um, graphic novels about the Tarot, I would say it is not as advanced as Alan Moore's Promethea. It is a little more serious tarot-wise than the Tarot Cafe, and it is almost as novel and interesting as uh, Bertrand Gael's 2017 wordless uh, Adventure of the Knight of Swords, a land called Tarot. So I really recommend this book. It, it is definitely one of my top four or five tarot graphic novels. Uh, it's 28 euro in Europe, available everywhere. I'm sure you can get it on Amazon or order it from your local indie bookstore. And of course, you can get it from the highly reputable um, Arcana Sacra uh, site itself. They have a reputation of making high quality fine products. You see this also in Robert Place's deck and that's definitely borne out in this book here.